welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are doing another one of the craft fair uh, shares of projects that are going to be in my craft fair series this year, or in my craft fairs this year. Uh, this is a inspired by something that I saw at Dollar Tree, um, and I was trying to like do the measurements for it and trying to kind of figure out how to do it. And I was just kind of on the struggle bus and the engines were not firing as far as, as far as math was concerned. And so I went to good old YouTube and I found a video that I had saved a long time ago from um, the Paper Posh Lady. And I will link her video below. It's for this particular project. Uh, so it's her tutorial for it. Um, and I just used some Paper Studio paper to, to do it and post-its from uh, Dollar Tree. Uh, I bought the post-its around back to school time, so there was lots to choose from, um, and they were fairly inexpensive, uh, just because there was a whole gobs of them because it was back to school time. So um, this is the project for today. It does have a little magnet closure that just kind of snaps back on. Um, this is the side, this is the back. Uh, really pretty paper. Um, you could use ribbon, you could use, um, nothing if you wanted to. You didn't have to necessarily have a, a closure on it at all, but I thought that was quite nice. Um, and it just unfolds like this, and you've got a whole bunch of post-its in there for you. So um, you can leave it on your table like this, or you can set it down. Um, this would be really great for somebody, a teacher. Teachers always need post-it notes. Um, this would be really great for your uh, Sunday school teachers for your kids, for yourself. If you've got a job where you are constantly having to jot down notes, this would be great to keep by. Nobody has an actual like phone anymore, but you know, hard line phone very often anymore. But um, if you've got a place that you quite often find yourself needing to jot down a note, whether by your bed, wherever it may be, if you have a home office, this would be a great little option. Again, I, I thought of students and I thought of teachers because I know that they quite often need post-its. So um, this just folds back up like this, and then you can snap your belly band back on, and it holds itself closed. So I thought this was a really great project. Like I said, I first was trying to copy something that I found at Dollar Tree, just got some inspiration there, uh, and ended up finding um, the Paper Posh Ladies tutorial, and I will link hers below. Uh, hers is perfectly great to uh, follow and if you want to make something like this or just watch in better detail how it was made um, that will be linked below for you to take a look at so thank you so much for spending time with me I hope you have looked and enjoyed looked at and enjoyed all of the other uh, craft fair videos that I have shared whether they were a tutorial or a project share I hope you've enjoyed them and I appreciate you spending time with me. If you want to see the tutorial for this, I will link it below for you. And until then, we will see you next time. Bye.